Hi, my name's Josh Burt from Action Corrosion. Today we're here to do a demonstration to show you the effectiveness of some rust removers that are currently on the market. First of all, we have the Metal Rescue Rust Removal Bar, the Avapo Rust Bar, and finally our product that's new to the market, the Rust Bucket. All of these products are very safe to use. They've got a pH between six and seven. You can put your hands in them and they also are perfect for de-rusting motorcycle petrol tanks due to their safe nature. The metal rescue and the Avapo rust come ready to use, so you're looking about four to five kilos for these products. The difference with the rust bucket is that we supply it in a concentrate, and it's a powder concentrate which weighs about 500 grams. Freight is expensive these days, so by providing a concentrate alternative, which is light, there's an instant saving on freight in the store, which is passed on to the consumer. With Metal Rescue and Avapo Rust, the majority of the formula is water. At Action Corrosion, we say, why should you have to pay for water? And that's why we've provided this in a concentrated form. Obviously, this demonstration isn't under laboratory conditions, but we do stress that these are genuine examples of the products, and that if you do a similar test at your factory or at your home, You'll get, you'll get similar results. The metal we will use in this demonstration is mild steel, which has been heavily rusted, and it's three millimetres thick. We've used three clean pails for this demonstration. First, the metal rescue. One plate. Next, the vapor rust. You can see it's a yellow. And finally the rust bucket, which is obviously a powder. Add five litres of water. Give it a stir. One plate. We just had a bit of a wardrobe malfunction and we've sorted the sign up back there. So back to the testing. We've now got the metal plates in there. We'll just set a timer. And then what we'll do, we'll come back in about half an hour and see how the test is progressing. 
Uh, back to the testing, as you can see on the timer, it's 37 minutes in. Okay, we will start with the, uh, the metal rescue. So there hasn't been, there hasn't really been much removal, but in our experience with this product, it does work very well, but it, it is a slower uh, working product. A vapor rust is the next one. As you can see, it's a pretty good result for 37 minutes. Still have some rust down the bottom. Um, still a little bit of pitting there, but not a bad result. And finally, the uh, rust bucket. You can see the clear liquids turned a yellow rust color. And of, out of all the samples, it is shown to be the best result after 30 minutes. Oh, we're concluding the test now. Um, you can see on the time it's, it's one hour and seven minutes. So we'll get each plate out so you can have a look at what they've done. That's the metal rescue plate. That's the vapor rust plate. And finally, the Australian made product, which is the rust bucket plate. Includes the testing. We have the three plates here in order of how they performed. Once again, I just want to um, elaborate that these products all do a very good job. Um, I'm sure if we did the same testing overnight, we get similar results for all of the products that we've shown here today. It's just that some work quicker than others. Um, and obviously I've pointed out the fact that this is a uh, this performs as well as the other products, if not better, but it's better priced. I can say that it, roughly in our market here in Australia, it's uh, priced approximately half the price of this product here and is a lot cheaper than this product here. The following still shots show the results of all three products when tested against rusted steel panels. If you've got any further inquiries about our Action Corrosion range, or in particular rust bucket, you can go to our website, which is all the w's.actioncorrosion.com.au. If you have a sales inquiry, sales at actioncorrosion.com.au.